from our point of view, what we see is we see uh, enormous skill development as well as the knowledge. So we really like the fact that they're becoming uh, you know, specialists on marine biology and freshwater biology, but the skills that they're using to actually find out and complete the tasks are our main focus. From the point of view of, of, of raising attainment, I think the fact that we are tackling skills uh, that are going to enable the students to deal with uh, courses that are coming in National 4 and National 5 can only help raise attainment because they're becoming uh, very good at various skills like research and communication, um, teamwork, and in getting good at these skills they can then apply that to any learning situation uh, to help them to achieve. Um, well I enjoy um, getting the stars so I can get a higher award and I enjoy all the research in it and because there's lots of fun activities you can do on it and it's fun to do them. I'm developing research skills and teamwork skills, writing skills and these help me in English, geography and science. The Excellence Awards we have found have really made a significant difference to developing the skills that young people need as they progress through secondary school. What they do is not simply get the knowledge of whatever topic they may have chosen, the, the knowledge and understanding of that, and that of course is important in itself, but it's the skills they're developing while they are doing so. These may be skills in research, they may be IT skills, they may be communication skills, uh, resilience, independent learning, all of these. And these are skills that as they move on through school and indeed beyond school, they're absolutely crucial skills for life, learning and work. And we have found that as children have to cope with the challenges, not only of the new qualifications, but indeed as they seek positive destinations beyond school, then these are the very skills that will make the difference. As well as obviously allowing the, the students to work on the skills and develop the skills and, and also to broaden their knowledge of science and social subjects in, in other areas. It also allows them to, to reflect on their learning. Their learning is very much with the, the students and uh, through that self-evaluation they are really taking responsibility for their own learning and hopefully that's embedding that, you know, that kind of uh, ethos and culture within the students to carry that forward so they can be successful, not just academically, you know, but in life in general, you know, taking that responsibility, having the confidence to take on uh, a task uh, uh, themselves and be able to learn from it and improve upon it each time.